late lunch. Um, it's about, let's see what time is it? It's about 2.30. So I'm having a little late lunch. This is after I've done all of my shopping. You guys, it's a madhouse out there. I have to take a breather. I can't. I can't do all of that. I'm, I don't know if I'm claustrophobic or what. I can't do all of the people and all of the hustle and bustle. I can't do it. I may end up doing the rest of my shopping on Amazon. On my storefront. Seriously. I mean, there was a lot going on today. I don't think I can do it anymore. Uh, I don't. <laughs> so we'll see if I get around to going anywhere else. But anyway, this is what I got for lunch. I got a a chalada and if you are a Taco Bell fan you remember the um, Anchorito this is just like the Anchorito in my opinion better than the Anchorito and I also got they give you this little bowl and stuff in case you want to share I guess um, or whatever but I got napkins sauce um, and this is my super taco it's, it's long pretty long taco it has lettuce, tomato, uh, sour cream, cheese. I'll show you. It's a good, it's a good taco. It's a good taco. I'm gonna put some sauce on that and I'm gonna dive in. You guys, I swear I am just beat. That that outing today, uh, the shopping part, <laughs> I'm beat. Ross is kind of a job in itself because you have to look so hard. You have to, if you find something you like, you gotta find, if you wanted something to match it, you have to find, takes you another hour to find something to match it. So. Mm. Taco is so good. Sour cream on there. I'm gonna cook dinner tonight. Um, Ty wants chicken, mashed potatoes, and okra. I was supposed to stop somewhere and get the okra, but I forgot. So I have to go back out, get some okra. Dr. Pepper. I always need something strong. When you're eating Mexican food, that's what I think anyway. You need some strong. I'm gonna use a spoon for this. The spoon works better. You see how cheesy it has the, the black olives on it. Look at that. Look at the cheese on that. It's wonderful. It has beans and meat. And cheese and red sauce. They're just a lot more generous with the cheese than Taco Bell used to be. And Taco Bell took the enchilada off of their menu, then they brought it back, then they took it back off. So I was glad when I found another place that has. An enchilada type something. I love Mexican food, but um, takes my boyfriend to tell you about that. It's like you love Mexican food. <laughs> we don't want to eat Mexican food up every day. But I could, I really could eat Mexican food every day. I just, I love it. Tex-Mex. I've learned to make a, quite a few Mexican things that I really like so that I can cook it at home. Mm. I haven't perfected enchilada yet. My chicken enchiladas are pretty good, but the like just the regular cheese enchilada or beef enchilada, I'm not satisfied with my 
my recipe he had. Probably like any other recipe, you have to do it a bunch of times to get it just right. Here guys, I call myself getting ahead of the game today. I said, I'm going to get out there um, before the weekend, get in and get my stuff and get out of there. That was my plan. There were people everywhere. Do you know what I'm saying? I say there were people everywhere. There were people everywhere. You couldn't go down the aisles in peace. It was, you know, how you go down the aisles at Ross. There would be three or four people down each aisle, and you never could really get all the way down unless you came back around the other way. I can go back out there for shopping anyway. I don't think I, I might have to just go ahead and finish up online. I'm not playing. I'm not kidding. I kind of like the idea of coming out. And, you know, looking at all the stuff and being able to touch it and look at it and see what size it is. And I love that. But the convenience of it coming to your door and you're not having to say, excuse me, 55,000 times to get to where you're trying to go makes it worth it. It makes it, makes it worth it just coming to your door. It's better that way. Y'all, do not forget that if you are an online shopper, you're going to be an online shopper this year. If you're looking for anything on Amazon, go to my store front. I earn commissions on qualifying purchases that you guys make on my storefront, my Amazon storefront. There's a link in the description box that takes you to my storefront. As long as you're shopping on my storefront, I receive commissions earn commissions so and if you need anything from Amazon go through my link to get it uh, I have little shopping link uh, list in my storefront that you can go look at there may be something in there that you like if it's not anything in there that you want you can just go up above my picture and use the search bar put your put whatever you're looking for in the search bar and it'll come up but keep me in mind, you guys. Keep my link in mind when you're shopping on Amazon. Really would appreciate it. That taco is a little cold, but it is good. <laughs> it's really, it's, I love the meat. I love their meat. It's real meat. <laughs> Tasty. 
hits the spot for sure. I didn't eat anything for breakfast this morning, so starved. <laughs> Starving. Guys, I can never make people know what my name is. So they just put Linda. They put Linda on everything. Starbucks, I'm Linda. Capo Casa, my name is Linda. Though I say, Jer Linda, they shorten it for me and say, I've never shortened my name. My name has never been, I've never been called Linda. I have a cousin named <clears throat> Now, Alicia, and we've always called her Alicia, for short. But nobody ever called me Linda, for short. So I can't let them do it starting now, I can't. Okay, you call me Jolinda all my life. I can't let anybody call me Linda. <laughs> now that I'm age, I am. Can't let it, can't let you do it. So, I'm gonna have to start getting corrected. I'm gonna have to start correcting them. No, my name is Jolinda. Spell it all the way out on the cup. I'm sorry, it's eight letters. I'm sorry. That's too hard for you. Just three more letters than what you're writing already. So don't. Come on. Come on. There's people with names names longer than mine. Stephanie is a long name, but people can spell it. Uh, no, there's a lot of long names that they have to spell. How, what are you putting on her, on Stephanie's coffee? Steph? Don't do that. She might not want to be called Steph. Steph. Like I said, unless a person is that's their nickname and they've been called that all their lives. Which Starbucks, you wouldn't know that. So just call people what they what they say their name is. Say their name is Linda. Put Linda. They say Jer Linda. Put your Linda. It's that simple. If you don't know how to spell it, ask me and I'll tell you. Now I usually make it easy for people I say. Jerlinda, and I say it's spelled G E R Linda. Jerlinda. Simple. But it's been a thing all my life. People call me Gerlinda. Gerlinda. Oh, it's Jolinda. My mom always told me to correct people. If they say your name wrong, you tell them what your name really is. Don't let people say your name wrong. So, I'm going to get back into that. I, it shocks me when people say it right the first time. It just it, it really makes me happy. Because <laughs> it doesn't happen often. There was a girl on TikTok that made a video to me. And she's like, I don't, I need, to, I meant to ask you, what is your name, Jerlinda, or is it Jerlinda or Gerlinda? I was like, you had it right, the first one, Jerlinda. And she was like, oh, well, I got it right the first time. I was like, yeah, you got it right the first time. And most times, it's not as hard as it looks. If you just say it, you're going to end up saying it the right way. If you just try to say it. Well, I just inhaled that. No, I was hungry. Mm. Good to the last bite. Okay, guys. That's all for today. Thank you for joining me. If you haven't subscribed to the channel, hit the subscribe button. Also, hit your notification bell. Also, go over to Cooking with your Linda. And hit the subscribe button over there and the notification button over there as well. And um, 
I will see you guys in the next video. Bye.